Hey YouTube, Wheelie Man here. We are rocking the latest software, 2020.44.25, I believe it is. And we're just gonna show you quick how the updated uh, software is handling the newest Navigate on Autopilot full self-driving features. So we've set a destination. We ordered a pizza from Round Table. We're gonna go pick it up. And you can see right there, the vehicle had a little bit of a uh, brain fart as it struggled to decide which lane it should take as the lane split from one to two We're stopping nice Yeah, so we're currently running software version 2020.44.25 Let's get these cameras up and running So how is everyone doing? Hopefully you've all purchased some Tesla stock in the last uh in the past 12 months and are enjoying the ride we've been having. I know I certainly am. Okay, green light. Tap the accelerator pedal. Stopping for control. So the light is green. Stopping for control in 200 feet. I just tapped the accelerator to go through. So we're cruising at 35. Let's see how it slows down for this curve. 33. Yeah. Pretty much maintained a pretty good cruising speed through that. Slowed down to 26 as it made the final turn, but really nice. So we're gonna cruise up here. 75 initiated on the, oh, it slammed on the brakes. Not sure why it did that. Okay, we'll go ahead and accelerate. So there are a few hiccups still, even with the latest Navigate on Autopilot, uh, not full self driving beta version. Vehicles initiated the turn signal to get over. So a few more hiccups than I expected there would be. Uh, in every version, I like to see some improvements and this particular version, uh, it did take that turn, the initial on-ramp turn, uh, probably the best it's ever taken it. So I will say there's that one step forward. However, the hiccups were it was deciding which lane to take when it split into two and then all of a sudden slamming on the brakes when that car passed us up on the freeway on-ramp. Uh, so two steps back, just like Elon predicted earlier with the FSD beta. So one step forward, two steps back. So I think it was a tweet perhaps that he sent out. But okay, moving on. Getting ready to come to our exit here. Yeah, lane centering on the highway still brilliant no real changes that I've seen or setbacks from the latest update probably get a turn signal indicator here there you go and will it take the exit yes so we got 35 on the speedometer still showing 65 sorry 35 on the speed limit sign still showing 65 now it's going away as we exit the freeway. And red light is seen on the instrument cluster. Okay. Will it stop at the limit line? Let's see how close it stops. Yeah, that's probably three feet from the line. So that's pretty, that's pretty solid. So we're gonna wait here until it gives us a green light and kind of creep forward, let's see. If I give it a little, okay, beep and say, hey, don't do that. Initiating the turn, back on. And here we go, turning into the parking lot. We made it. There we go. Cool. Well, thanks for watching, everyone. That was just a little preview of the Navigate on Autopilot update for 2020.44.25. Hope you all are having a good day out there, and happy holidays to everyone. Please like, subscribe. See you in the next video.